Okay, let me get a fork. I, I figured that Facebook wasn't going to allow me to do, you know, that. So I just had to come back live. Okay. Woo, honey, if, if I tell you guys the pain that I feel from the workout that I did yesterday, that workout, it was so goddamn intense. It was a bit much, but you know what? I'm doing it again today. Okay. I'm doing it because you know why I'm going to do it again today. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I could challenge myself. Going forward, when I do what I want to, I do my, my nose was itching, my ears. What I do going forward is I, um, I use, I just use one, um, Dang the coconut milk. This is really good. When I was downtown, okay. Thinking, ooh, I could buy me something from outside. I knew the devil was lying. Okay, I I knew he was lying at that point and moment. Okay. Mmm. 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 No, no, no. We will not. Okay. We gonna go home and make those darn mushrooms. Okay, that you don't that you don't brought. <clears throat> uh, it's got like a little kick to it. It's not something like you won't enjoy. Right. All right, it do got a little kick to it. Let's get let, let's get some some of this sauce on this plantain. Mm. That's how you do it. Mm-hmm. It don't take long, okay? Mm. It don't take long to cook at all.
Life is good. Life is life is really good. Really good. Look at that mushroom. You ain't ever know that was a mushroom. You were sitting up there saying, Oh, that's chicken. Well, no, it's not. Okay. Gotta get that sauce. Okay, gotta gotta get the sauce out. It's so funny, right? I used to be like, you know, like when you're younger, and you like. Maybe, like, you don't want to, um, like, eat a certain type of way. I don't... I think even in my, my, um, my 20s, I was, you know, like, oh, shy, like, you know, don't want to eat a certain way, okay, Nowadays, I'm like, you better pick that fork up, okay? And, and you better eat like, you better eat like you normally eat, okay? Everybody got a time to be eating like you, you fancy, okay? Now, sometimes, mm, sometimes I get in my bougie ever, okay? Sometimes, just sometimes, not all the time, just sometimes, okay? Um, but when I get like that, Okay, sometimes I gotta remind myself, or sometimes I'm, I just stick with, with the flow. Okay, I just run with the flow. Okay, I'm not even gonna lie. Okay, so let me tell you it's so thick. Okay, yeah. I'm trying to show you guys the mushrooms. Okay, honey, that's mushrooms. No, honey, this is mushrooms, okay? You thought this, you, what you thought this was? Mm, that, that mushrooms. With a little jerk sauce. Okay? All right? That's mushrooms. And and what else? What kind of noodles? Oh, these chickpea noodles. Okay. To be exact, chickpea rotini noodles. Okay. And then we got elbow plantains. Okay. I just want to know. Mm. One question. That's all I have. Uh, I just have one question. I missed it. That's it. That's it. I just want to know. How do the Spanish or the people from the island, okay? Th this is this is my only question I want to know. Now, if somebody can answer this, it'll be it'll be worth it, okay? It'll be worth it to me. I only want to know how do they get the plantains? Like, 
I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. Like the plantains be look well, I guess now I kind of understand it because I'm about to answer my own question. Because I'm like, they plantains, the Spanish people plantains don't look flat like this. Okay, the Spanish people plantains look kind of fat and thick. Don't take that the wrong way, okay? Because I, I, you know, I, I just feel it, okay? Your mind is in the gutter. <laughs> Excuse me. So now I'm thinking is because had it cut it. But they plantains, they, they, they don't look like this, okay? They plantains look more like golden brownish. And real, real soft, okay? Now, I'm not critiquing my plantains, okay? Because I, I would never do that, okay? But I'm I'm just interested in how do they get them like that. That's that's my only question. I don't, that's my only question. That's it. No, that's it. You know what else would have been good with this? Um, some jalapenos. Or whatever you may call it. That would have been good with this. You see that dog on pepper fell? If you guys wondering, right? Cuz maybe I would be wondering there too. Right. What do she drink? The only thing I really drink is water. Okay? From time to time, every now and again, and that's like very like few in between okay i mean like literally like every noun and again i may have me some um like um like something natural or i may do is it what's that drink called and is a um is a pure biotic and they sell it at target I can't think of the name of it. Um, but something like that, like I would have like every now and then. Um, but for the most part, I'm drinking water. Mainly water. Okay. Mainly water. Oh, this is not, not chicken. This is a mushroom. Just a mushroom. Just a mushroom. Mmm. Damn, I was supposed to go on YouTube. All right, come on. I'm full. And I was supposed to eat some of this on YouTube. All right, family, I'll see you guys later on tonight so we can work out together, okay? Now, again, I will be doing that workout I did yesterday. I mean, that workout, it was really freaking intense. I mean, oh my goodness, boy. Every part of my body felt it, okay? Even up until today, my, my glutes... My core, even the damn bottom of my damn feet, I guess from all the times I was doing the calf raises, my arms, honey, they, they just, my arms is just like this. Okay, they, they, they just, because that workout, it was so got darn intense. But the reason I'm going to do it again today is because, one, I like the challenge, okay? That's one. 
Do I really look forward to the challenge? Not necessarily. Okay. But I like it. I like it. So that's why I'm going to do it. Because it definitely push, push, pushes me out of my comfort zone. Shit, I'm talking all this mess and I'm now I'm thinking about it like, oh my goodness, do I really want to do it? Let's see. Let's see. You know, because yesterday I had put on Toya and Juice and those are content creators that's on YouTube. And I'm quite sure they on Instagram, probably on Facebook too. Um, but I found them on YouTube. And yesterday, that video that I did with that workout with that lady, okay, I don't even know the lady name, but honey, the body is cut up like no other. And I was on Juicy, Juicy, I was on Juice and Toya video, but for some reason, the lady video came up first, that hour long workout. As, you know, like you see the video and you, and I'm like, oh, I could do this. But then I was like, man, cause I told my oldest son, like, you know, I'd be ready in 30 minutes that I'm gonna work out, you know, 30 minutes. And what happened was, look, I, I done told you guys that I was going on YouTube. Hmm. What happened was, instead of, oh, that's good. That jerk seasoning, boy, you can taste it. It's good. Um, what happened was, I seen the lady video and I said, "Oh, that that'll be good, right?" It's a hour long workout with dumbbells, and I said, "Oh, that'll be good." But then I thought, you know, thirty minutes. I told my son, and said, and then I said, "No, let me do soya and juice workout." And I guess the universe had, like, this type of sense of humor, like, you know, like, nope. Um, because I put Toya and Juice workout on, but then the next minute I know, the lady, I must be pressed some button. Don't you know that hour long workout came on? Okay. And I wasn't going to back down from the challenge. I, you know, that's just not my, that's just not my thing. Okay. I wasn't going to back down. And so I said, I'm with it. Okay, let's go. Okay, now my sister, my sister Melissa said, she told me, after I did the workout, and I spoke to her later on yesterday, I said, listen, she said, it looked like you was about to cry. I said, cry? I said, I'm an OG. OGs don't cry. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. I said, I wasn't about to cry. He said, well, in the video, it really looked like you was about to cry. I said, girl, girl, I wasn't about to cry. Was I pissed off? Hell to the damn year. I was so goddamn pissed off with that instructor. Okay. I don't even know the instructor. But I was so pissed off. And the reason being was... Because she was pushing me. She was pushing me. Am I grateful for her content? Absolutely, yeah. Okay. But as I told you guys, this lady is cut up. Okay. And I, I, I should have known from looking at her her body, her, her stomach. I mean, she got more, more cuts in her stomach. Okay. Than a butcher cut me. All right, cause that's how cut up she is. And I, I should have known at that point in time, I should have said, Dina, you know this is going to be a, a, an intense workout. You know that, right? But no, I said, you know, we're going to do the workout. You know, the workout is already playing, okay? I'm definitely not going to back down from the challenge, okay? And so I started getting into rhythm, started getting into, until I seen she kept doing these workouts over and over. Like one workout is the same. Then the next workout is different. Then the next workout is the same, just like the previous one. And I just was like, damn it, lady, what are you doing? I was so pissed. That workout was so intense. 
normally I don't take naps throughout the day. Now, before I used to take like so many naps, but normally now I don't take naps, hardly, okay? That workout was so intense. I felt so sleepy. <laughs> I felt so damn sleepy. And and before I knew it, I was sleeping. All right? I was, I was sleeping. Not for a long time, but probably for like two hours or so. I was asleep. And then when I woke up, and I ordered me and my children some food. And then later on at night, I think I went to bed like 11 o'clock. Honey, I was I, I was out for the count. Okay, I I just was I just was so I was honey tired was an understatement because that lady done pushed me to the she done pushed me all the way. Okay, and you know so so stuff like that. You know I'm I'm grateful for the challenge. Like I'm really really grateful. For the challenge. This got like a like a peppery. And I guess that's from the jerk sauce. But it definitely got the peppery. Not like real hot that is uncomfortable. Like now, right? Like now. I'm so happy I made enough because now and that's another thing right like when you when you like go to to the eating plant based more plant based right one of the things that's very important is the cooking is the cooking and, you know, I say all the time, like, food is so overrated, okay? And if if you're not cooking and, like, you buy junk because, you know, at times I go to the supermarket and I'm like, oh, this would be good for my kids. But to me, I think what it is is, like, like, damn, like, this would be good for me, <laughs> Right? And I done seen so many videos where, so, you know, they say the dairy ain't good. Um, it, it causes, it could cause cancer and all this, you know, different things and stuff like that. But it's definitely a process, okay? Definitely, it's definitely a process. So, you know, keep on... Keep on believing in you, boo. Keep on doing what works for you. But if at any point, if at any point you're doing something and you see that is affecting you, okay? Because listen, ain't nobody was, let me tell you something, okay, before I go. Now, I was supposed to finish this on YouTube, but since you guys kept me on here, all right, since you guys kept me on here, now, now I'm going to just finish it here. But I got enough for later. I could go on YouTube. Um, now, earlier, I did a video about boundaries, right? And let me tell you something. God, source, whatever you deem source to be, do not care. You know, in a sense, we as though if you crying because you in so much pain, or if you feel like you know, I just want to, I just want to change. I, I just want my life to be different. And you keep on crying. But then you keep on doing the same thing over. I'm telling you, your life ain't finna change. Okay? I'm, I'm tell And I'm telling you, I'm telling you that from a place of love and a place of 
you really are capable of doing so much better, okay? Because I told you guys before, you know, I, I would cry and cry and cry because the way I allowed people to treat me and I would cry. And, you know, we all heard this saying, most of us, you know, as a kid, God ain't gonna put nothing on your plate that you can't bear. But what if I told you, you actually the one that's going to the buffet and putting the stuff on your plate? You. No one, no one else is putting it on your plate. Okay? And so, all of that God isn't going to put nothing on your plate that you can't bear. No. You got to take accountability. You are putting the stuff on your plate through your perception and do what you believe you deserve. Uh, excuse me. So, if you think... If you think you don't deserve... Great health. Guess what you're going to do? You're going to sabotage it. If you des if you feel you don't deserve wealth, um, abundance, or, you know, or having money, guess what you're going to do? You're going you gonna to feel like you you going to spend everything, okay? Now, I'm not saying, like, you know, circulating your money and stuff like that. Um, because I used to get confused with that. I used to be like, yeah, but, you know... They say, you know, abundance is your birthright and stuff like that. But to me, if you spend in every dime, right, then there's a part of you that may may believe deep down to your core. And I'm talking to myself with this one. That you don't deserve to have money, okay? Because you want to hurry up and get rid of it, okay? And money is energy, okay? Money, money is just simply energy. So... If you believe like, oh, I don't deserve this, guess what? You're going to do stuff to convince yourself so you could be right. Like, you know you know what? See, I knew, you know, I knew I didn't deserve that or I didn't deserve that. Look, right? Because it's what you've been telling yourself prior to. And this goes for everything. Oh, for the relationships, okay? Look, look you see, it's, it's getting cut up, okay? I'm, I'm, it's getting toned, okay? That goes as far as everything. It's not just, you know, one thing or whatever. That goes as far as everything. It's how you really perceive yourself. And sometimes we can be so unaware we can be so unaware of how we really see Abigail that we keep on doing the same exact thing. And when someone else come along and be like, you do this because of X, Y, and Z, then you say, oh, the person play hating on you. The person don't want to see you win or whatever it is like that. And at, at times, that's really not the case. At times, what it really is, that they just calling you out. And it's not from, you know, now granted, sometimes I guess it could be, you know, but it's, I know when I say certain things, like if I say certain things like to my kids and stuff, or to my sister, okay, is always from a place of love. Is always from a place of love. And before I was in the habit of just voicing my opinion, right? Like just, Voice in my opinion. And then what I noticed was everybody don't want your opinion. You know, every everybody don't want your opinion. Sometimes people just they just wanna keep talking about the same goddamn problem, the illusionary problem over and over and over again. Cause you know, to be frank and honest, because some people just like the goddamn attention. They like the attention of the problem. And you wanna know which people I'm talking about? The ones that you could tell something to. And they always they always seem like looking for something else to go wrong. Like, you could say, well, you know, well, start doing this. You know, I guarantee it would be a change because you're doing something different. And they say, no, no, that ain't gonna, that ain't gonna change it. Those people, <laughs> they, they like the attention from the problem. So that's why they keep on reiterating it. So listen... It's been real in, in the feel like, it's been real in the feel like holy feel. Honey, I told you guys I'm a rapper, okay? Just sign me, okay? 
Let me stop saying it. All right, family. With that being said, I'm about to wash these dishes. I don't have that much to wash, but I'm about to wash these dishes. And I'll talk to you guys, to you good folks, later. This was definitely like a meal that, um, so good. It's fulling, okay? It's very fulling, okay? Um, and it's like savory. Oh, it got the, those spices. You taste the spices. So good. Just so good. Okay? All right. That's to go.